So that goodness, it starts with your family and then extends outward. And that's the last thing I want to share with you about this ayah. Is that, first of all, there's the minimum relationship with Allah. Then it's your parents. Then it's close relatives. Then it's neighbors. What does it seem? It seems that the thing that is, cl the, the relationship that is the closest, most intimate to your heart is first. Then we go to human relationships and the most close human relationship is what? Your own, your own parents. Then closest relatives, which of course includes spouse, children, others. And then it moves outward. And why is that important? Because unfortunately you find the reverse sometimes. You find somebody who's very nice in the community. Really nice to people. Salam, how are you? Gives you a hug, checks on you. Really nice guy. Except when he closes the door behind him and he gets home. Then he's Fir'aun all of a sudden. You wouldn't even recognize him. You would not recognize him. What happened to this guy? The, the, the voice changes, the temperament changes. He becomes somebody else. Allah is basically telling us in this sequence, there's no point of you being a nice guy outside. If you can't show that first to your own parents, to your own spouse, to your own children, if you can't do that first, you can't ex extend that goodness first, then everything outside is fake. That is of no value and of no consequence. Right? So this, this ayah I wanted to highlight because in a, in a very realistic sense, I acknowledge that men have quite a few pressures on them. If you're going to be able to fulfill your responsibilities, then you have to make sure you are at least receiving some of your most basic fundamental rights. You have to receive your rights. Because that is a need of the human being. If you're not, if for example, if your children don't respect you, if you don't give you the minimum respect, just not even say salam to you, it'll eat away at you. It'll hurt you. And it'll, it'll affect you in ways you don't realize. It'll affect maybe the way you deal with other people. You know, it'll affect you emotionally, spiritually, psychologically, it'll have other effects. So fix those relationships, not just in fulfilling your ob obligations, which comes first, but also at the same time, learn to demand your rights also. But not go out, you know, out of your way in demanding your rights. You have, you have certain rights and you're entitled to them. May Allah make us a people of balance.